billion solar masses, 200 to 400 billion cars, and the thickness is about 1,000 light years, and the whole thing has a radius of about 50,000 light years. Okay, good enough, move on. Okay, next step. Uh, the stars that are in it are actually kind of going around like this, whereas the ones that are in the bulge are kind of doing this. <laughs> Why are they going up and down? Why aren't they just going straight across? Why are they doing the wavy thingy? What kind of gravity? Good, move on. Okay. <laughs> So how do galaxies evolve? Basically we're doing how is the uh, whole thing formed. You'll see it's a lot like the stars, what we've done before. Okay, so. Yeah, I'm just going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if we look back in time, what we see is galaxies which are much different than what we have here, okay? Further off, what type of galaxies are these right here? Irregular. Young, yes, thank you. <laughs> They're all irregular, exactly, okay? We'll get into comments about that. Okay, so we have the elliptical one here. It's going to be a lot faster if I should restart. Right? Okay. So we, then after, as we look further and further through time, we start to get these objects that we're more used to, so the spirals, the elliptical galaxies. A lot less of the regulars can be put there. There's a whole lot of regulars in the young part of the universe. Okay, um, so we need to take this into account, is really kind of the idea. So how do we form a galaxy? What do you think we need? <laughs> Thank you. We need more time. We need more time. <laughs> like I should let it die. Okay, let's just let's just uh, go through my memory right here. Okay. Okay. Good. I have a good idea what I'm going to talk about while this thing restarts. Okay. It's like a bomb. And the presentation is over.